morning. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is April 7th, Tuesday, April 7th, and I am at home, as you guys can see. Sorry, I'm adjusting the lighting here. You guys are probably wondering why I'm at home, because I officially don't have a job. <laughs> Temporarily. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I got laid off yesterday i worked yesterday and then right before i left my manager told me that i am getting temporarily laid off because it's not busy and it just doesn't make sense for everybody to work so we are watching toy story if you guys can see um and madeline's here hey baby what are you eating huh she has a green smoothie in here which she's almost done um, and she's having banana with uh, blueberry waffles this is like her signature so she eats that quite a lot she likes it we kind of just give that to her but um, Tyrone he always mixes it up because you know I'm more of like a quick and easy type of person and he's more of okay let's give her something really good uh, and I'm gonna be eating um, some lunch it's 10 30 right now um, as you can see here, so I'm just gonna warm up my food and then eat like brunch. It's a little bit early, but like I said, quick and easy, eating some leftovers. I did not ask why he chose me. Um, I guess I had the right to ask, uh, just because it is my position and like, obviously I didn't get to choose to be laid off, but at the same time, it's not my choice to get laid off, so there's no reason for me to even ask. Even if I wanted to know, it's not going to change anything, you know? So I was like, okay, whatever, you know? And then he's like, oh, HR is going to send me some emails, some information, um, just so I can sign up for employment insurance. So that's that. Um, so I will be applying for employment insurance today, so I'll be on that um, indefinitely. Um, I don't know when I'm going back. He never gave me an exact date. He never told me. He just said I will be on temporary, laid off till... He calls me to tell me when to come back. Hey guys, I am back. I don't remember what I was vlogging last. I think it was sometime this morning. Um, I don't know what time it was. I think it was like 10 or 11-ish. Now it's 3 o'clock. Madeline went down for her nap an hour ago. Um, what we actually did, we just ate, kind of hung out, just chill, watch TV. Um, me and Maddie, we read some books. She had a snack. You know, um, I did some computer stuff and Tyrone actually came home. He has a break in between his shift. So he came home and we kind of just hung out. He played a little bit of games and then we just chilled and spent time together for a little bit until he went back to work. He went back to work like 30 minutes ago. As you can see, I just took a shower because, well, since I'm here, let me talk to you guys about how we had a flood. Those things happened within a whole entire week. We had a flood. Some of the things uh, that we had uh, kind of got damaged. Um, not really damaged. I was able to like wash some of the clothes and some of the old stuff that Maddie used to use in the laundry. But um, the bins and the boxes that we used uh, and stored it in were damaged. And then we had to move everything out of the way. And then I lost my job. So there's that. That's why you can see all of these things here. These are all the stuff that were in um, the storage room, which is the furnace room that is here in our basement apartment. Um, and I do have some stuff in the bedroom as well, which I will probably show you guys later on today. But um, when Maddie's awake, long story short, um, the water tank, the heat and um, the hot water tank wasn't working and it I guess leaked I don't know something busted and then it was leaking all over the floor um, in that um, storage room and it was just a little bit at first and then he's like oh it's fine you know they would the water will dry up it's not that bad and then like maybe a few days or like a week later it just flooded the whole entire storage room so we had to move everything out of that room bring it into our apartment and he got a new tank oh, he fixed it the hot water works now during that time i think we didn't have hot water for like three days so we went to our parents house to shower um, we did not wash dishes we couldn't so there was a whole pile of dishes that needed to be washed so we ended up using um disposable uh plates spoons and um cups and things like that for a few days currently watching a thriller movie right now the one that i am watching it is called secret obsession and 
it's about a girl who gets into an accident but this movie is called secret obsession and if you ever watched um sweet life on deck you know the girl named london the asian one that own the, owns the hotel or like the daughter of the owner of the hotel um sweet life she's in it I forgot her name brenda song that's her name <laughs> and she is kidnapped she got into an accident and then she doesn't remember anything and the person who claims that he is her husband is not actually her husband <gasps> i think madeline woke up hold on say good afternoon good afternoon <laughs> here we are watching the b movie um and i have no memory in my memory card so there's that too <laughs> Gonna get something to eat for Madeline and then, yeah, see what else we're gonna do. Maybe go take a walk outside if it's still nice. Doing some artwork. We got some glitter glue and we also got some um, paints over there. Wish I had pastel paints, but the dollar store near our place didn't. Yeah, okay, okay. There's four, five. 